Laboratory at the museum would probably be pretty familiar to anybody who's been in, say, a university laboratory. So we use uh, the broad range of analytical techniques. We do spectroscopy, both molecular and elemental. We do chromatography in the gas phase and the liquid phase. We do a lot of microscopy using both light as well as electrons. And then a lot of the more esoteric techniques, thermal analysis, accelerated aging. So quite a range of uh, techniques. Quite a use range. Them. And, um, why is it so important to understand the chemical degradation of an artist's materials and how can it help to improve our understanding of cultural heritage? Well, if your goal is the long-term preservation of the artwork or the cultural heritage, if you don't understand what its weaknesses are, what's going to lead to its degradation, you won't be able to stop it. 